Oh, something new in the mail today. What is it? Oh, what is a Shark RF open spot? Oh, that looks interesting. USB charger. Looks like everything that is needed, including the Ethernet cable, is in the box. This is for my DMR radio, my Titera, what is it? Uh, it's a 590. I forget what the letters are in the book before that. Anyway, let's go to the next step. Let's get this all going and on to the next. Good thing my radio waited until I had purchased this before it bricked itself. The open spot seems to work fine. The radio, not so much. Hey, YouTubers, radio hobbyists, how's it going? I'm not having a good day. My newly acquired DMR radio from Titera has decided to go white screen. And that means from what I've researched, it's bricked. This thing will never work again. No matter what I do, firmware, flashing, it's toast and it's brand new. Brand spanking new. So is my Shark RF open spot. So I've spent in Canadian dollars, between the two of them, 500 plus. And I will never see them work once. I am not happy. I'm going to have to see about, uh, seeing what I can do about returning these things. But I'm going to take a loss, no doubt. And I don't even know if I'm going to be able to return a bricked transceiver so um, so take this as a warning uh, hands out there wishing to try DMR the software out there comes with risks and I've been burned today don't get burned Well, hopefully that's all for today. If I have any updates on this, I'll let you guys know. Anyway, 73. Hope you guys have a good weekend.